Now, dry January is quickly becoming a trend. Have you heard of this? It's a commitment to hold off on any alcoholic beverage for the entire month. News 8's Nina Criscolo is here with new research released about the benefits of this. Nina. Yeah, these experts say the biggest takeaway after you take a month away from alcohol is a new perspective. Your relationship with it would, could be different. More control of your drinking and decreased alcohol use down the road. But this research shows the tangible benefits are really adding up as well. 88% of those people reported saved money. 7 out of 10 experienced improved health and better sleep. And most felt they had more energy, lost weight, and many say they had better skin. We talked to Dr. Danielle Henderson at IU Health, and she says if you do set a goal like this or another New Year's resolution, to make sure you put out detailed plans on how to keep on track. It's wonderful to set lofty goals, but you have to work daily and in small chunks to get there. And then also be kind to yourself when you're making a behavior change. It's hard. And so recognizing that it's going to be hard and that you're going to have to be patient and be compassionate towards yourself. You fall off the wagon for a day, you can just keep going. That's okay. The research out of the UK did show that those who took part in dry January 2018 were still drinking less when they filled out surveys in August. A poll there shows 4.2 million Brits chose to participate in dry January this year, and there have been more than 126,000 posts on Instagram using the hashtag dry January. Now, health experts say the good thing about dry January is that it's not at all about January. This is something you can do any month of the year. Year. And if your first reaction to it is no way, experts say you might really want to consider giving it a try. And remember, next month is the shortest month of the year.